Alright, so already there are a few questions being raised. One, why is Sonic Adventure 2 Battle being uploaded during the Summer of Shit? Two, why am I revisiting this game? I have no idea what happened, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm going to assume X-Death just wanted my episode. My episode 15 of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, which I had done over a year ago, suddenly is gone. It's no longer on YouTube, and I have no idea why. I checked on Game Anyone, it showed up there, but it was, you know, deleted, saying that I couldn't find it. So, pretty much, I can't leave a playlist incomplete like that. So, I went out of my way, and I re-recorded the stuff that was going on in Episode 15, which covers into White Jungle, the Sonic boss fight, and quite a few cutscenes. So, I apologize for this, but without further ado, I think we should get started with this. With <laughs> White Jungle yet again. Cut through the jungle in 10 minutes. Remember, Rouge got locked inside that vault because, you know, Master Thief, which again begs the question, why doesn't she just, you know, go into, you know, showing the fact that she's a secret agent? I mean, do the people of Gun not know that she's a secret agent? She works for them. Then again, maybe they don't tell each other these things. If you couldn't tell by now, yes, this is post-commentary. I apologize for this, but you know, that's kind of how I had to do it. So, obviously, at this point, I had all the upgrades for it, but there is an upgrade that you will get inside White Jungle. That is Shadow's Light Speed Dash ability. I will be showing off where it is that you end up getting it, and I greatly apologize for this. I don't know what the hell happened to the episode. This was just brought to my attention today. Today is July 3rd, 2014, that the episode was gone. So, it was just brought to my attention today. So, yeah. Anyway. What we can be looking out for in here are Big the Cat cameos, because the Big the Cat cameos were added back into this version of the game and out. So, yes, the Big the Cat cameos were initially inside the Dreamcast version, and they were inside the enhanced port for the, on the Dreamcast by a DLC that you could do. And they were re-added into the battle version of the HD game. They were taken out of the GameCube version for some odd reason. I don't, I never could figure out why exactly they were taken out, but oh well. All I can tell you is that, believe me, going back to this after playing 06 for a little bit made me appreciate this game a lot more than really it was before. So originally in the LP for this, my grade on this was a B, so let's hope that I can end up, you know, fixing that, because, you know, Bs are not acceptable. Crap. And let's go down this way because we're actually almost through this. I think that the 10 minute time limit is way too much time because if you're spending 10 minutes inside of White Jungle, then something's obviously wrong or you don't know how to play. So this right here is the area in which you will get the light speed attack. If you can see right here, if you already have it, you can simply just light speed dash right there. But seeing as how I need to show you guys, let's go down this way and Right on this pedestal, you will get the air shoes. The air shoes are basically the equivalent for the light speed dash or shadow. How do you do it? Well, just get close enough to rings and hit the circle button on the PS3 version of the port. I do not know which button you hit on the, you know, Xbox 360 version of this, so, oh well. But we're already almost at the end of the stage, actually. The stage is very short, which is why, again, I think the 10 minute time limit is more than gracious. Heck, I thought the six minute time limit with Sonic was too much. Oh well. So, there's Big. You know, Big, this place is going to blow up. You might want to leave. Wait a minute. You know what, Big? No. Stay right there. Wait, then how will I do Sonic Heroes like I did in the past? No. Well, Chow Key right there. Not dealing with because don't need to. And... Whee! 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 And there's the end of the stage. So... Not bad, especially because the last time I played this game was six months ago, and that was the GameCube version. The last time I played the PS3 version, ladies and gentlemen, was over a year ago. That was with no practice. I am not joking. Ultimate victory. Indeed. So, I think we should go on to a boss. Hmm. I have enough time to kill. Sounds like I think I should go and beat the shit out of someone. That blue hedgehog again of all places. I found you, Faker. Faker? I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Huh. You're not even good enough to be I'll my fake. So Technically, we're, I consider we're both fake hedgehogs, because I'm pretty sure hedgehogs are not three feet and anthropomorphic. And yes, there is one Sonic. That is you. So keep that in mind. So pretty much it's the same as when we fought 
Shadow as Sonic, same battle applies. What I was trying to do here is there's actually a glitch inside the HD port to where you can cancel out your spin dash animation, but the hitbox is still active. And as a result, Sonic's AI is programmed to basically just run into you. So basically, you'll be standing still and Sonic will just suddenly be dying. It's rather hilarious. And it works for Sonic when fighting Shadow as well. So I unfortunately couldn't do it. So instead, I want to kill this hedgehog. So, pretty much get over here, and what am I gonna do? All right, I'm just gonna have him run into me. No time to hang out the likes of you. Oh, burn! And now for the remainder of this episode, cutscenes! Which apparently we wasted more than seven minutes doing this battle. What the hell? Shadow, what are you doing? Hurry and get back here right now before the island blows up with you on it! Blows up! And which, as we saw right there, there was 128 left on the clock, and now a minute, and now Sonic apparently had six minutes to run through everything. Timing be damned! Chaos control. And just skipping that FMV cutscene because it's just it blowing up again. Shadow, what do you think it's like on Earth? The professor said his life's work was dedicated to all of those who live down there. He once told that the reason for his existence was making people happy through the power of science. Oh, I can make many people happy with science. I just don't know anything anymore. I often wonder why I was created, what my purpose is for being here. I also wonder why you have the flame ring inside of a cutscene from the past. Answers, maybe. Why so melancholy? That was so unexpected. So unlike you, Shadow, to come and rescue me. But your ability to use the chaos control certainly comes in handy. Hmm. You know, I didn't come to save you. I came back for the chaos emeralds. Yeah, yeah, but then again, that's not the whole story, is it? Everything is ready to go. Are you sure? We only have six of the seven Chaos Emeralds, you know. That's more than enough for the demonstration. So let's get the show on the road. And now, back to Day X. Sorry, I wanted to leave this one in. <laughs> Citizens of Earth, lend me your ears and listen to me, Mary My name is Dr. Eggman, the world's greatest scientist, and soon to be the world's greatest ruler. Now, the beginning of the greatest empire of all time. really impressive. You've managed to create complete havoc on the whole planet. Does this now mean we control the planet and can do as we choose? At this rate, the cannon will take too much time to charge up. If you want to unleash its full potential, you'll need all seven Chaos Emeralds. Where in the world have you been? Something happened? Our threats fell on deaf ears. I blew up the fucking moon! Throwing a tantrum like a little kid. How totally embarrassing. Don't forget your end of the bargain, that girl. What about that last Chaos Emerald? We had a deal, right? So where is my emerald? Here you go. I found this. Why didn't you show me this before? This 
Station Square, saved from a life-threatening... I have no idea what happened with the cutscene right there, ladies and gentlemen. I ended up taking these from my Sonic Adventure 2 Battle 1 on the GameCube. I don't know what happened. ...was given the Chaos Emerald as a testament of his heroic deed at a ceremony held at City Hall. <clears throat> this makes things a whole lot easier. Hurry, go back to Earth and find them fast. I want that Chaos Emerald! Did you get that? Soon enough, Maria. This is Ruth reporting. Currently, I have not been able to confirm if Shadow is the ultimate life form or not. I will continue my research on Project Shadow and have a follow-up report very shortly. Just a reminder, don't forget about my jewel. Sneaky, sneaky! So... There we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is pretty much what the basis of episode 15 was. I apologize if this seemed a little bit slapped together because, unfortunately, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle HD doesn't have the ability for you to watch cutscenes again. So I happened to have a file that was up at this point for my other version. So I took the FMV cutscene from the GameCube version of Battle that I own, and I took that version of the cutscene that you just saw that just glitched out also from there in which, you know, my cutscene's kind of completely screwed up. So I apologize for that, ladies and gentlemen, but hopefully I don't have to do this again. This has been Roxas1359, and go back to the past recordings. Sorry. <laughs>